The sign says chickens for sale, alive and dead. And on this farm, when they say dead chickens, they mean birds that died, usually from stress or disease, before they were slaughtered. It turns out that there are plenty of chicken carcasses to choose from. One worker told RFA that 40 or 50 chickens die on this farm every day. He says the dead ones sell for about 30 to 40 cents each. At that price, sausage manufacturers and street vendors around Shenzhen are eager to snap them up. It's difficult to get up-to-date information, but an investigation in 2007 found that 80% of chickens that die on farms end up in China's food chain. Roast duck on Shenzhen's streets is also suspiciously cheap, selling for as little as $3 a piece, a tiny fraction of the price people pay in restaurants. Sources told RFA that many of these birds are also purchased dead from farms at rock-bottom prices. Consumers, of course, are horrified to discover that the poultry they eat may have been bought as carcasses from farms. I would never dare to eat that. I'm terrified at the thought. Who wouldn't be? Safety first. That's all that's on my mind. China has a love-hate relationship with the chicken. Poultry is increasingly popular on Chinese dinner tables. The U.S. Department of Agriculture estimates that China will consume nearly 13 million tons of chicken in 2016. But after repeated outbreaks of avian flu in China, which have left hundreds dead, many Chinese regard chickens with suspicion. But selling dead chicken and duck carcasses for human consumption is another matter altogether. Dead chicken, dead birds, cannot eat. OK. This is 100 percent because you know usually these birds died, especially large amount of birds died. This, there must be some outbreak, disease outbreak, maybe infection disease. You contact this bird means you take a, a big risk to kill yourself. China has one of the world's poorest records for food safety, and many Chinese consumers wary of frozen meats prepared to buy live chickens. That's something to keep in mind as China awaits the go-ahead to begin exporting poultry slaughtered in its facilities to the United States.